Cozy season is officially here. The air is crisp, the leaves are turning, and MailTrap's latest updates are ready for you. So wrap yourself in your favorite blanket, grab something warm to sip, and let's ease into what's new this autumn. To help our users manage complex setups with multiple teams, environments, and products, this autumn we've released organizations and sub-accounts. With this feature, you can now create dedicated spaces for each project or client, set custom permissions for team members, and keep analytics clearly separated, all while managing everything under one main account and one subscription. Each sub-account acts as its own fully isolated workspace with separate sending domains, templates, stats, SMTP API credentials, and team access, ensuring actions in one workspace do not impact the others. And if you already have existing accounts spread out across your MailDrop setup, don't worry, migration into sub-accounts is seamless. No leaf raking needed. Our automations feature has also evolved and officially moved out of its alpha and beta release phases, making it fully available across the MailTrap user base. Of course, we had to add some novelties as well, like new triggers and building blocks, so you have more flexibility in what you can automate and how your workflows run inside the platform. But before you go and check those out, a quick reminder to click subscribe and hit the bell icon so you never miss new videos or updates on MailDrap features. Staying focused on making life easier for developers, this season, we've rolled out a major update across all of our SDKs, including Python, .NET, PHP, my favorite, and Node.js. The SDKs now cover all methods and include tidier documentation as well as cleaner examples. So, if you're planning to integrate MailDrap into your system, that task just got even smoother, clearer, and faster. And that's not all. We've got more to share. We've launched a public roadmap and feedback hub under feedback.mailtrap.io. Here, you can submit feature ideas, vote on what's important to you, and follow along with what we're building next. There's also a public change log, so you can see what's new the moment it goes live. Well, I hope you'll still be watching our seasonal updates. And speaking of launches, our Trust Center is also up highlighting MailTrap security practices, compliance measures, policies, and certifications, all in one place. And yes, SOC2 is almost here. We're working closely with independent auditors and have automated monitoring in place to keep our controls strong and steady. And as our last update before we get back to enjoying sweater weather, we've introduced a Contacts Export API. It allows you to transfer contacts, including filtered segments and lists, straight into your workflow or external tools. It's a small addition, but one that makes contact management and data sync much more flexible. And that wraps up our batch of autumn updates, gathered, bundled, and ready to enjoy. As we settle into the season, we'll keep working on the next round of new features and improvements with more to share soon. In the meantime, if you'd like to dive deeper into any of the updates that we talked about, our docs and how-to guides are all up to date and ready for you. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.